Welcome back everyone. Today I will introduce to you road surface template matching, automatic extraction of road signs, and new template recognition and drawing. When the amount of data we need to process is large, we can use AI to customize the range of batch road surface identification extraction. First, click on template matching and use AI in automatic mode. There are two processing modes here. GPU and CPU. If the performance of the computer graphics card is high, you can choose the GPU mode, and the software will list the GPU model and video memory information in the GPU setting interface. If the computer has multiple graphics cards, be sure to pay attention to manual switching. It is recommended to use an NVIDIA graphics card to automatically extract the logo in GPU mode. It is recommended to select only ground points in the category setting, reducing the input of useless points to improve processing efficiency. Then use the three-point drawing frame method to detect. Multiple targets can be framed for recognition at one time. Of course, the fully automatic AI method provided by the software can also be used to extract road signs. Click the road marking batch process and the setting dialog window will pop up. Here it is also recommended to do a point cloud classification first and only select ground points as the source category input. If the performance of the computer graphics card is high, we can choose the GPU mode. Click OK to start fully automatic road surface mark extraction. After the extraction is complete, the software will store the zebra crossing in the crosswalk layer by default. Vectors such as arrows and pedestrian crosswalk warnings are stored in the layer of road marking. Whether it is template matching or road marking batch process function, the recognized results are all stored in the built-in layer of the software. When the size of some symbols is not the national standard size, we can customize the template for drawing. At this time, we can create a new table and add some descriptive fields as required. Then select this custom table and switch the template matching to manual drawing mode. Click the add button to pop up the new template dialog window. In this dialog box, set the symbol name, symbol color, symbol line width, whether to fill, the line type displayed in the symbol and the descriptive content. Then draw the template vector on the point cloud according to the template of the point cloud to be drawn in the order of nodes. The first and last points must be closed. Finally, double click to end the drawing and then click OK to save the template. In the new template table, you can see our newly added template. Among them, red is the starting point of subsequent manual drawing and green is the end point. Of course, if we switch to the automatic mode, we will also use the three-point frame to detect. Here, pay attention that only one target can be drawn at a time. This is the end of this video for the introduction of road surface template matching, fully automatic extraction of road signs, and new template recognition and drawing. Thanks for watching.